So this week, I was at the all new club Academy LA in Hollywood to see trans DJ duo Gabriel and Dresden. But if you've ever wanted to see an EDM DJ at a club, then you're gonna wanna stick around for my six tips in this video. Ready? Let's go. Hi everyone, I'm Doug and this is Fat Boy Doug, a channel with an appetite for life. This channel is all about giving tips and advice on how you too can live a happy and fabulous lifestyle. So if you're new here, please consider subscribing below. Okay, so this weekend I was at Academy LA and I was there watching Gabriel and Dresden, this trans DJ duo. They're part of the Anjuna Beats label, which you may know of from Above and Beyond. And they were also there at Common Ground, which was Above and Beyond's tour for their newest album. And this is actually Gabriel and Dresden's tour for their album, The Only Road. So if you haven't heard it yet, go on Spotify, iTunes, I'm sure you can find it. It's a really good album. But on today's video, I'm gonna give you tips on how to survive your time at an EDM club. So you may wonder what's the difference between a regular club and an EDM club. At an EDM club, it's all about that one DJ that you're watching. Maybe they have special guests or openers, but you're there to watch that specific DJ. At a regular club, yes, there's a DJ, but they're not the main focus. You're there to kind of dance and socialize with your friends. Here at an EDM club, you're really paying attention to the music and you're focused on that DJ. And the clubs themselves may have more strict guidelines or dress codes, which is my first tip, check the dress code. When you're going to a regular club, you may just be wearing t-shirts, shorts, but at an EDM club, they like to make it more upscale and they do have a dress code. So you wanna check on their website to see what that dress code is. Specifically for Academy LA, they told us no sandals, no shorts, no tank tops, no backpacks, and no offensive graphics. I've actually been to clubs where they told guys that we had to wear button up shirts or at least shirts with collars. So you really wanna check the dress code beforehand so you don't get turned away at the door. Which brings us to tip number two, don't wear anything gray or light colored. At an EDM club, you're gonna be packed in there with a lot of people, so you're probably gonna sweat a lot. So my tip is to wear darker clothing so you don't see the sweat marks on your shirt. You just don't wanna be that guy that looks all sweaty. So even if you are really sweaty, you can kind of hide that with a darker shirt. But for tip number three, to make sure you're not actually that sweaty, I suggest bringing a fan. So I actually checked with Academy LA beforehand to make sure that I can bring a hand fan into the club. Again, there are strict rules sometimes for clubs, so you wanna make sure that you can bring a fan first, but it truly is a lifesaver when it's really hot and you're packed in there with so many people. It just feels so good to fan yourself. Plus, you can make friends by fanning other people. I actually do this a lot. I'll just stand there and turn around in a circle and fan everyone around me, and everyone is so thankful whenever I do that. It's definitely a great conversation starter. They'll ask you where you got it, what kind of fans you have. So if you're interested in getting your own fan, then I suggest going to www.clackthatfan.com. I've included a link below, but it also includes a promo code for you to get 10% off on all the fans. They have a whole bunch of awesome designs that you're gonna wanna check out. So check the description below for that link and that promo code. But for tip number four, another great way to make friends is to have gum with you. Not only is it good to keep your breath minty fresh, but it's a great way to make some new friends by ripping your gum in half and giving it to them. So I suggest getting the type of gum that's the stick of gum instead of the little capsules so that you can rip it up and share it with someone else. All right, tip number five is actually one that I shared in my rave gear video, but it's super important and is earplugs. I was actually going to film this video at the club, but it was so loud and the bass was so heavy that there was just no way that you could hear me on camera. They definitely upgraded the sound system in there because I had been there before when it was still Create and it was not that loud. But thank goodness I had my earplugs. If these were not in my ear, I'm pretty sure my eardrums would have been blown. So they're great at EDM festivals outside, but it's actually even more important to have them when you're in an EDM club inside because the sounds can reverberate and it's just gonna make it even louder. So you really need these to keep your eardrums healthy. And my last tip for you is don't be that rude person to push your way through the crowd. So we're all there to watch the DJ and yes, it gets crowded and I'm sure your friends are in different locations in the club, but there's a right way and a wrong way of going through the crowd. So many times there are people that will just move you aside by pushing you over and then just walking straight through to where they need to go. Sure, it may take a few more seconds to ask nicely to see if you can move past this person or maybe just tap them on the shoulder and let them know that you wanna get through, but that's just so much better than just pushing your way through. And my bonus tip for you is to bring your fan with you as you go and fan the people in front of you so they can let you through. 
All right, so I had a great time at Gabriel and Dresden, but where are you gonna go for your next EDM concert or festival? I'd love to know in the comments below. And also make sure to check out my other videos right here and subscribe to my videos here and click the bell notification so you'll know whenever I post something new. Also check the description below for your promo code for clackthatfan.com where you get 10% off everything there. All right, everyone, thanks for watching, bye.